Today, Her Excellency, the Right Honourable Dame Cindy Curdo, visited two of New Zealand's leading nurseries, Waikato Stud and Cambridge Stud, to learn a little more about the industry the late Queen was so passionate about. We spoke to Her Excellency, along with a few other industry participants, on what is a very special day for the New Zealand racing industry. Yeah, well, I just think it's fantastic to have Her Excellency on farm and um, at Waikato Stud and her party to show interest in our incredible industry and for her to, to learn a bit about what goes on on an operating farm like this and the success of the uh, horse people within our industry and, and obviously the horses. For us to be able to give that message across to her, uh, what an incredible industry we have. I think it's a great honour to, to have Dame Cindy here and the, her enthusiasm for the industry is ju has just blown me away. I just. I feel so confident that in her role she'll be she'll be quite positive in the way the industry's going. I just loved her enthusiasm. Oh, it's an honour for the stud to have her come and visit the farm. And it's just great for our staff. It's great for the whole industry. And um, what a tremendous lady! I mean, she made us all feel so relaxed. And um, I guess we're all nervous to start with about the protocols, but um, just can't imagine how it could have gone any better. It was really, really good. Your Excellency, can you please explain the significance of your visit today? Well, there's really two parts. One is because it is still the Platinum Jubilee year for Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. It's really an honour of her great love and passion of the equine industry that I wanted to come and really pay respect to the industry. I know that she really loved coming here. She loved visiting the stud farm. She loved visiting people associated with the New Zealand industry. And the second is because I recognise that New Zealand Punch is well above its weight in terms of our ability to breed champion horses, to treat them well and then to race them. You mentioned the Queen's love and passion for the thoroughbred horse and industry. How has today's visit given you further insight into that? Well, I've managed to meet uh, some champion horses already and of course I saw the amazing Heritage Centre here at Cambridge start. So I've seen the way in which horse can have such a legacy. So if you get a horse like Sir Tristan, mm. the legacy that he leaves can go on for generations. And I think I've really come to understand that idea about the importance of that ongoing legacy of the breeding program. Mm and also how important it is to be able to get into New Zealand horses of that calibre so Absolutely. that we can make sure that we're competitive, particularly in the Australasian market, but also worldwide. This is a global industry and New Zealand Punch is well above its weight globally. And we also have, let, let's face it, we have some of the best grass in the world and the horses are kept in this amazing environment. Mm. Uh, we have year-round conditions that are pretty suitable for them. And mm. I can uh, appreciate the effort that goes into what are really these amazing creatures. They sure are. Prior to today, have you had much experience with the thoroughbred racing industry? I haven't, no. I have met horses. I've even been on some. Some memories were not that happy <laughs> for me. Um, but I was just so impressed when I met the horses already mm. this morning. They are really quite exceptional mm. specimens, aren't they? they are, their proportions, their musculature, just, you know, their whole being. And actually, interestingly, when I patted them and spoke to them, they were very receptive. They mm. were listening very really att attentively. Better than my dogs do to me. So <laughs> they're, very, they're very social animals. What yes. has been the highlight of your day today? Did a particular horse perhaps catch your eye? I yes. met Saberville. I mean, he's extraordinary. 21 mm. years old and still looking in such amazing condition and still able to basically sire other horses. So uh, he was very special. And, uh, you know, I've just seen some of the yearlings coming out of here. I mean, they're just magnificent. I've learned about turn of foot. <laughs> I've never heard that before, but I've learned that phrase and the importance of that. Very important. You want a horse with a good turn of foot. Look, thank you for making the time to visit today and also speak with us. Oh, uh, and we hope to see you back sometime soon. Thank you.